Good morning, guys. Um, it's a little bit before 11. Um, I just woke up. Um, I'm cuddling with Rosie right now. I don't know if you guys can see her. Hey, Rosie! Hi, baby. Such a sweetheart. Oh, my gosh. Hi. Come cuddle with me. She's so cute. Um. Oh, hi. Hi, baby. Okay. <laughs> anyway, so, um, my mom, like, three weeks ago, right? It was, like, right after my seizure. My mom got her first set of prescription glasses, and she tried wearing them for a few days, and they were, um, she said that she felt like she was floating and that her peripheral vision was, like, messed up, and she tried driving with them, and she said that she felt like it, she was going to get into an accident. Um, hi, baby. So she, <laughs> so she, um has been wearing like the non-prescription like glasses that you just like buy you know like wherever and i was like are you serious like you just paid to get prescription glasses and you're not wearing them um like we have to go back to the store we have to go back and she was just kind of like br brushing it off and i keep bothering her about it and so finally last night i was like we have to go like tomorrow and get them fixed and so she actually called this morning and the place is open so she's gonna go um we're gonna we are going to go get her glasses figured out figure out what's wrong with them and um in the same um complex is in her complex like strip mall great hold on Okay, sorry, so pain management called, um, I was supposed to see them today, but I made the appointment just now for the 21st, which is next Wednesday, um, but, um, yeah, we're gonna go to Trader Joe's afterward, I wanna check out, um, food that I might be able to get there, because I've only gone to Whole Foods recently, I'm, um, actually watching a friend of mine, um, her live stream, and... I'm waiting for my fusion to finish. That's pretty much what's going on today. So, see you guys soon. A makeshift thing to get my hair washed. <laughs> so, I know it's totally weird that, um, like, I wash my hair, or I have, like, sometimes other people wash my hair for me, but let's be honest, it's a lot of work, and especially when I have to have my pit covered. And, um, when I feel like I'm gonna pass out in the shower, so. Oh well, I know it's weird, but. Gotta do what you gotta do. And we are picking a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah, okay. That was, um, drink juice. Man, I feel like my hair looks awful today, so I'm sorry, guys. Um, so we got a whole bunch of new things we're gonna try we bought uh, matcha and uh, I'm gonna make that later um, they got like or she got a lot of food for like um, like her and my dad like frozen vegetables and stuff like that um, and then I'll do a, like a haul when we get home um, but we just got a few things that we're gonna try out so that's basically what's up. I'll give you guys like a little haul when I get back to my house. So not really too exciting. Very exciting? Too exciting? Is it too exciting? What? Not very exciting. Right? That's how you say it? Yeah, yeah. I don't know what I'm saying. Good girl, Rosie. Oh, you're such a good girl. Good girl. You said, oh, we could have gotten blueberries. Good girl, okay. Rosie. You got them. We're very okay, so I got this cold pressed juice. Has beets, cucumbers, celery, apple, carrots, spinach, ginger, and lemon. And then I got this black tea kombucha. It's a pomegranate and hibiscus. I got ghee instead of 
regular butter because it's supposed to be really good for you and your digestive system and I'm going to try matcha green tea later today, which I'm really excited about. What sucked though is that you have to see, hold on, back in the ingredients it has to just say matcha green tea powder and we found another one that was cheaper but it had like a gazillion things listed so we had to go with this one which was like six or seven dollars right for yeah. seven of them yeah which is kind of sad but I'm gonna try it yeah we've got my friend sitting with me so cute Aww. <laughs> Pretends that she's a baby. So we're sitting at the table, <laughs> but nobody can sit here. So I have three really yummy drinks that I can drink, and I don't know what to do. I want to have one of these. I could have the pomegranate hibiscus kombucha. I could have my cold pressed juice, or I could try making matcha. I don't know guys, I don't know what to make. I'm just having my like regular tea. Um, it is Tazo, I think that's the name of the brand. And um, it's called Passion. Hold on. Uh, hibiscus, orange peel, rose hips, and passion fruit. And so this one's really, 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 really good, so. I'm just sipping on that for right now, but I want to figure out what I'm going to make for my special drink tonight, because I want to make a special drink. We'll see. Hey guys, so I totally forgot to even mention this, um, but when we went to get my mom's eye, or her glasses um, fixed, which, let me say that they didn't do anything, and they were treating her like her concerns were, like, normal and not valid, and like, somebody that's I've worn glasses for 20 years and I know how gla like new glasses and new prescriptions are supposed to feel and I know that what she was complaining of is not normal um and so I was really the one that pushed her to go back to have everything looked at and everything um and they were just giving her like kind of a hard time about it I don't even yeah, I don't even know if she realized that they were acting a little bit weird, but it really pissed me off. Um, but I actually got my eyes checked. We didn't schedule this, but I actually had my eyes checked and my prescription checked. I actually also was able to choose glasses, um, which if and when I get them like ordered, I'll show you guys then. Um, but I ended up finding out, I was asking about how many years of stabilized vision, um, you have to wait to get like corrective surgery so that I don't have to wear glasses or contacts and he actually said because of EDS I can't have um, corrective surgery on my eyes I had no idea but he was like the the um, the risk is just too great to even contemplate doing the surgery so turns out because of EDS I cannot get my corrective surgery for my eyes which is perfectly fine because I was freaked out about that anyway because I like cut the top layer of your like eyeball and not happening but yeah um I'm just relaxing right now Rosie was here for a little bit just catching up on some YouTube um and yeah just relaxing so just wanted to give you guys an update because I had no idea that EDS would affect my eyes like that but learn something new every day Hey guys, so I'm just going to sign out for the night just because um, I'm probably going to fall asleep soon. I made my Dai Jai Zen rollerball. Um, it kind of just like, you, you put it on in like a, you do it clockwise around your stomach and you press into your stomach because it's supposed to help um, your colon move and everything like that. And it's supposed to relax the muscles and stuff. Um, I don't normally do stuff like this because I, I just find it, like, weird for me, like, awkward, but I am so, I don't even know if you can see it, I am so painfully bloated, um, and it's not like, 
I'm self-conscious. It's more about like I'm touching my stomach and I'm pressing my stomach and it's just like like I can feel it's like I don't even know. Like I'm I'm just really, really bloated. And this has been going on for a few days. So I'm gonna probably drink some dandelion tea tomorrow because this is it's like painful. Um but so yeah, I'm just gonna sign out for the night and I will see you guys tomorrow. And thank you guys for watching and if you're new here, hello. Um, maybe I'll give a little bit more of a better introduction because I've noticed there's been a handful of new people so maybe I'll do a better introduction tomorrow. But Oh, and we're supposed to get a snowstorm. Um, so <laughs> we'll see how it is because the snowstorm last week was like so fake. Um, so I'll let you guys know how that is, obviously. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.